right, man, I'm back in the building. What are you telling me? Um, you could probably see these, like, black patches on my face, bro. Literally. It's a chemical burn. That's what I... I did my research in it. I was wondering what it was, but people were telling me what it was, but I had to do my own research in it, but man, I got a chemical burn and I've learned not to mix products together, bro. I'm telling you, you got to be careful what products you mix together and use on your skin because look what happens. Fuck. This is what happens when you mix different products together and yeah, I'm telling you, only use one, one Pacific product, bro. Don't be using five or three or more, you know what I mean? But only use one. That's what I learned, bro. Because this is going to take like at least a month or a couple of weeks to heal. It's already, most of it's already gone. It's still going slowly, but it will go eventually. And yeah, literally, I just wanted to let you know that. But fuck, you know, man. Um, imagine I'm back on the same construction site where I used to, I'm back on the same construction site where I was just, Smoking on it and just doing all this madness, bro. Imagine this morning I walked off the site, went home, cooked breakfast, and came back. That's what I mean. This is why I like this site because one, it's local, it's just down the road, bro. You gotta understand, it's down the road. Um, two, these guys don't, they don't always look out for you, bro. You know what I mean? They always on a watch out like surveillance cameras, bro. Literally, I've been in places where people are like surveillance cameras, you know what I mean? Like, you can't go nowhere without. Someone just keeping an eye on you. Oi, where, where is he? Where's Dylan? Where is he? That's what I mean, bro. Here, I can just chill out, walk about, and just do nothing all day, bro. This is why I like this place, bro. Um, but yeah, I can't lie, bro. These CSCS things, when I, I'm only, the only reason why I'm doing this is so I can pay for the shit that I need. You know what I mean? Once... This, these jobs are like quick and easy, simple money, bro. I'm not telling you to work here long term and shit, bro. Literally, that's who wants to be working doing this shit long term. What I do, this is like a backup thing. I'm telling you, these CSES things are like backup. It's like a backup. Um, just in case if you ever need something like this quick money, you do something like this, bro. And this is what I'm going to do to get where I need to go. Literally, all I do is have to, to pay off my debt and pay off. Um, and buy the shit that I need, bro. I, need, I just need to buy my drills. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna buy my tools. I'm gonna buy my tools. So, yeah. Literally, big old expensive tools. Literally, I'm gonna be looking all professional when I don't even know how to even use them. Shit. Oh, man. And the last, the last one that he throwed out was that. <clears throat> imagine, imagine this, bro. Imagine this. These people called, called, this same company here that called me, they called me like, two, like on, back on Friday, they called me on Friday. Imagine I was in Primark, they called me. I was like, they're like, oh, we're like, are oh, you all right, Dylan? You're like, you want to come back for Monday? You're like, you looking for work? I was like, I was like, yeah, yeah. I was like, what? I was like, who's this? I was like, oh, it's Premier, it's Premier. You want to come back on Monday? I was like, yeah, no problem, no problem. I'll be there. You know what I mean? That, that, it's like, that was kind of like a blessing, bro. Like, not even a blessing, but it, it came right on time, bro, because once I, once that, because really, I've already finished like, the Heathrow thing now. I finished the Heathrow job. So this came right after it, bro. You know what I mean? And man, one thing I could tell you, bro, never get yourself in debt. I'm telling you, debt is the worst thing. Shit. I'm telling you, you never want to get yourself in debt. Always learn to stay out of it. Because life is so much more enjoyable when you don't have a debt over your head. That's one thing I learned. Literally, I'm just learning things when I go going throughout life. But shit. Man, I'm just getting myself prepared for the future. You gotta understand, bro. You really gotta get yourself set for the future and ready and to ready to go because no one's going to do it for you. That's how I realised, well, you've got to do shit on your own. Literally, no one ain't going to do shit for you. So, start putting in that work in your own life, man, and start getting places. But, yeah, man, these jobs are just funny, bro, I'm telling you. Because most time, all I do is just sweet. Walk. I'm telling you, bro, most time, I even just walk around all day. I just walk around all day. Um, either sit down on my phone or 
just chill. Literally, the only time I, I might work, I'm telling you, throughout the whole day, the eight, like, eight hours of working this day, I'll probably work for like 30 minutes, but I'm telling you, I'll just go around, sweep, done. Because they don't check up on you, bro, so I just do what I do and then go, go back to where I'm going, bro, go back to my hiding spot. And I get away with it because these guys are not onto me like that, shit. But yeah, man. Um, yeah, man. You just gotta stay tuned for more. I can't lie. My seam attention journey is still going strong. I'm still going strong in seam attention, so I'm just still documenting my journey. And that's why when you watch these videos, you're probably like, why does it feel like this guy is in a movie? Because I am in a movie, bro. You try retain for 900 days and you'll see how your life just becomes. Like, it's like a, but I'm telling you, it becomes crazy. You'll see what I'm talking about when you try it for yourself. But most of you will never get up here because you're not disciplined enough. But yeah, man. Um, life is crazy. But yeah, bro, shit. I made it all the way up here on my own, made it all the way, imagine bro, I made it all the way up here on my channel on my own without no one's help or nothing. And that's the best part about it bro, you wanna do shit on your own and actually say, you, you can give yourself the credit bro. I don't even give, I don't even give myself the credit, literally. I don't ask no one for no, the validation, I'd be like, oh, am I doing, I don't go ask people, oh, am I doing good, am I doing this, am I doing that, right? Literally, I just do what I do and just let people see and, that's it, bro. Literally, I don't care about people's opinions and what they have to say or nothing, bro, because nothing, none of that. Literally, no, one, no one's opinions help, bro, I'm telling you. Fuck. You just want to be tunnel visioned into your own life and just what you got going on, I'm telling you. Once, once you start to get all into everyone else's business and, you know what I mean, being nosy, you'll start to realise that life Life just gets worse for you, bro, I'm telling you. And when you just put that self improvement work working and just focus on yourself, you'll start to see how much better life gets. But man, man. You, imagine this, look at my phone. Oh, wait. Here, look at this, bro. I really did fuck up my phone, bro. Yeah, my phone's on the way of dying, bro, I can't lie. <laughs> look at the screen. Literally madness. But yeah, man. I just can't wait to see what the Lord's actually got in for me, what the Lord's got in store for me. Because I never come all this way and overcome all of them situations with all these people out with Marielle for nothing. It's time for me to elevate and start to get all the presence that I've been planting my seeds on, literally. I've been planting my seeds for a long time. And it's time for them to blossom and so I can get all of my blessings. And watch, when they come, I'm going to live it up. And I'm going to laugh. <laughs> but yeah, fucking hell, man. I might drop two. I might drop another one today, bro. But for now, that's it, people. But you got to stay tuned, as always. As always, well, you got to stay tuned because I'm always in the building, man. And yeah, literally soon I'm going to have the whole YouTube platform taken over. Well, I'm going to have the whole of YouTube and you're really going to, people are going to be shocked. I'm going to be some, in some big places in the future and people are really going to be shocked where I'm going to go. And I'm going to laugh because it's funny. Ha! <laughs> But yeah, man, stay tuned, and I'm out. Peace.